Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android Guy. Hey guys, today we're doing the streaming gaming review for the NVIDIA Shield Pro. Now this is a very different kind of gaming review because we're actually using the NVIDIA Shield Hub, which allows us to actually stream games that are very high-end and you can usually only get on PC gaming onto our NVIDIA Shield Pro. So, we're going to start off with Devil May Cry 4, go to Batman Origins, go to Homefront, and then finish off with a fighting game, which obviously is probably the hardest to stream and not have lag. Alright, so let's start off with Devil May Cry 4. Okay, so this is Devil May Cry 4. Start off with a little bit of a cutscene just to show just how it really looks. As you can see, it does not look bad at all. Not really a delay thus far. Let's kind of skip this and get right to the gameplay though, shall we? Bam. Not bad. So, pretty good all around. When it comes to all this, it's moving very well. It's not having any issues with it. So, yeah, pretty smooth gameplay. I'm actually pretty impressed that it looks this kind of quality and it's still not having any kind of issues with the gameplay at all. Alright guys, let's move on to the next game. Alright, now we're moving on to the next game, which is Batman Arkham Origins. And just letting you know, they do have the original trilogy on here, so Arkham Knight, Arkham City, and Origins. Alright, so it's been playing and looks pretty good so far in terms of a cut screen. And let's go skip this and see the gameplay. Pretty damn good, to be honest. Ooh, that's just messed up. A little bit of two-time action for my taste, but you know. Looks really good. Let me pause it for a second until we get to some actual gameplay, but so far the cutscene part looks really Alright, now let's get to some fighting. Spoilers, I might have played some of the Batman games before. Handles really well for fighting, to be honest. Alright, let's try the next game. And see if it's as good as this. This one did not do too shabby at all. Alright guys, so this is Homefront. Great first person shooter game. And just looking around, everything looks clean. Just driving, moving, all looks pretty good. Let's open the door, get beat up, and let's see how this goes.
get off of me. The sound is kind of weird, I would say that. Alright, I will pause it until we get to this, the fighting part. Alright. Now that I have control. So really good. In terms of how well it moves. And yeah, this is really great for a first person shooter. Doesn't have a lot of lag. Which of course is always good. Oop, and I spoke too soon apparently. Wow, okay, that was bad. Uh, but overall, for a lot of the beginning, it didn't lag at all, but yeah, you can see there's definitely some lag here. Uh, again, you want always the best internet connection, which you can see at the top, mine is actually not that good right now. So you always want the best internet connection possible. Alright, let's move on to the last game, which is a fighting game, which needs to be really good. Alright, now we're going to play Street Fighter Cross Tekken. And we're going to see how well a fighting game does under these conditions. Because that's one of the biggest important features, of course. Can you play a fighting game well? That very quick, no lag, no, no lag is very crucial to this. So let's see how it plays. And if it's really that good. Alright. I'm gonna take Chun Li. Cammy. Alright, let's see how it does. Not sure why it's taking a second. There it goes. All right. Pretty good. Pretty good, it's moving pretty well off. Not that bad at handling it at all. Try another second. Does really well, guys. All right, hopefully you did like that. That was the gaming review for the Nvidia Shield Pro. Honestly, streaming games is really fun on this and all these are free. Hope you liked it. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.